Offshore wind has rapidly evolved into a major contributor to the energy transition. But for this shift to green energy to succeed, we also have to ask, how can we ensure that offshore wind farms are installed in harmony with the environment? The monopile has gradually emerged as the standard foundation for wind turbines. To install these monopiles, large hydraulic impact hammers are commonly used to deliver a series of blows with a tremendous amount of energy. But this process is associated with strong impulsive noise that is potentially harmful to the hearing of marine life. Monopiles are therefore typically installed using a combination of measures to reduce underwater noise to an acceptable level. For example, flexible screens can be deployed around the monopile together with big bubble curtains that surround the construction site. Alternatively, the noise mitigation system not only reduces underwater noise very consistently, but also provides contractors with the benefit of an enlarged installation window in harsh sea conditions. The NMS can even help reduce installation time due to the integrated pile positioning and survey once installed. More recently, new pile driving procedures and damping systems, such as Pulse, have changed the pile driving techniques to reduce noise levels at the source while also decreasing pile fatigue. Protecting marine life against underwater noise has become an essential part of the installation of monopiles and the development of new installation methods. But how are we currently balancing the environmental impact, reliability and cost of these noise mitigation measures themselves, as well as their impact on the foundation design and installation? With new pile driving technologies on the horizon for the installation of XXL monopiles, Will current noise legislation still be effective in protecting marine life? One of these new technologies is EQ piling technology, which delivers a series of long-lasting blows with longer intervals. EQ piling technology is particularly suitable for the installation of XXL monopiles and minimizes pile fatigue. Although this generates less noise, as well as noise with a much lower frequency, marine life may exhibit different flight behavior depending on the frequency range to which the hearing of certain species is most sensitive. By comparison, vibratory pile driving equipment has the potential for faster installation times and reduces the risks of a running pile. But how do we cope with uncertainties about the bearing capacity and drivability? And what will the effects be of continuous underwater noise from pile vibrations on marine life, which is as yet unregulated? Pile driving technologies and noise mitigation measures clearly have an impact on the foundation, installation costs and reliability, as well as on the underwater environment. Because of this, iQuip is open for dialogue and ready to work with biologists, regulatory bodies and developers to ensure the continued development of offshore wind farms in harmony with marine life.